Here we're trying to figure out if it's a left-tailed, right-tailed, or two-tailed hypothesis test. On the left side of the screen here, I have a two-tailed, which is when your alternative is not equal. Left-tailed is when you're looking for a value less than your null. And right-tailed is when you're looking for a value more than your null. And what we're looking at right here is just the alternative, h1. So in this one, p is greater than. So that means we're looking for a large p-value, which is to the right. So this is a situation we have here. We're looking to the right. Right-tailed, submit. So that's greater than. Go for a new version. This one greater than would also be right. Greater, greater. Oh, well, I just went right by one. All right, not equal, good enough. All right, this one's not equal. So it's not left or right. It's going to be two-tailed. Your uh, value could fall outside here on either side. So it's two-tailed. And now I'm looking for a less than. Here we go. So P is less than 49. Uh, so the test is, in this case, we'll, we're right here. So we're looking at a left-tailed to see if it's too small.